guys, we already started stripping this down. We got it sanded as well, washed up, degreased. Um, I didn't get that on video because, you know, it's a lot of work and stuff. And it's been real hot out. So here's the rear wheel assembly. I got to take this apart, get this all cleaned up, and then get the wheels done as well. There's the other piece. I just took off the handlebars and the little bracket. So we'll get to this after. And then right now I just want to take off the forks. And then once I rip these forks off, then uh, we can have just the frame. And then I could hang it up and then we could start painting it. So yeah, we're getting there, making progress. We got our motor for it as well. So we're gonna be using this motor. It's a 110cc, uh, four stroke, four speed, semi-auto. So it's easier, no clutch, stuff like that. So that's what we're gonna be using for it. Um, so yeah, stay tuned because this build will be coming up. And here it is. All right, you guys, we got it fully stripped down now. Nothing's on it no more. Ready for paint. I got it lifted up on some blocks. Uh, the color we're gonna be going with is burgundy. So that's the color of the frame we're gonna be doing. And uh, yeah, this today's video is just all about painting the frame. You know, little progress is better than no progress. So let's uh, get to it. I'll put you guys on a little time lapse and uh, we'll get this done. So we're just gonna lightly coat it right now, let the paint kind of tack on. Okay, so here's the frame fully painted. Came out really nice. So here it is. I don't know how it's gonna look on the camera. It might pick up like if it's red again, but I can assure you it's darker than that. But yeah, check it out. It's nice and shiny now. Everything's painted. So we got the frame done now. So now we'll put this away. Well, we'll let it dry out for a couple days. And then after that, we'll start getting working on the wheels. We'll start getting on the wheels, the brakes, and then the rims, the rear end, the shocks. We'll get all that cleaned up as well. And then we'll get all this painted too. And then we can start putting it back together. And then we can put our motor in. And then, you know, start ordering up the harness and a bunch of stuff. All right, we got the frame all done. It's all cleared. So it's painted, cleared. And then uh, over here, we got the rims done. Rims are painted and cleared as well. This color is really nice in the sun. So that's for the outsides of the Forks rims. and everything. We did wrinkle black. 
Um, it's still drying, so it looks like this right now. But once it dries, it'll be all nice and Here's coated. The other well. parts that are already drying. Here's the hubs, the brakes. Here's the old engine. Of course, we're not using that no more. But here's these pieces that are already done. So yeah, and then our last piece, I have it sitting right here on top of the Predator, the swing arm. Um, it's all done already as well. Nice little textured black. Everything's finishing drying. So once everything dries for a couple days, then we'll be putting this back together. These things were a pain in the ass to get out. Look at these tires and the tubes. So you can imagine the rims. The rims were so rusted in there. It took me literally two hours just to take these off. But yeah, so we gotta get into new tires. I mean, these tires are done. Look at this, they're disgusting. So we gotta get some new tires, tubes. So for once the paint dries, then we can put everything back together. And then our motor, of course we got our motor here. So our motor's right here, ready. Um, I got parts for it as well. I got new shocks for the bike. And then I got the harness and I got everything ready. So um, we're almost there. And then after that, we just gotta set, do an exhaust setup for it. And then uh, we should have a running bike. So stay tuned you guys on this build. This was the paint process. I didn't really record all of it. It's been too, too much work to record, but uh, yeah, this is the paint part. Um, I'll start recording more when we put it back together and stuff like that, putting the wheels together, wheels, and uh, the, uh, all the pieces. But yeah, thanks you guys. I appreciate you guys watching, and until the next one.